Seven years old, I am undergoing training in Advanced Jet Training Squadron PF Academy of South. I decided to join PF uh, because I was um, very much uh, uh, motivated by the discipline and the uniform and their uh, their pomp, their show. Plus, I always wanted to do something which was different than normal routine. My mother is sometimes concerned that uh, it's a male-oriented society and the job I'm doing is very different, uh, very extraordinary. So, um, her concern is there and I respect her concern. But uh, she also stands by uh, with, my, with my decision and like, she is happy for me as well. We get up early in the morning, um, 5.30, 6 o'clock, then we just uh, reach to our squadrons and uh, we uh, take our uh, breakfast and we rush to our uh, uh, IPs for briefing. They brief us regarding our present day mission and we uh, go for, for the air aircrafts, we strap up, go for mission, come back, we get debriefs. They are treating same as to males and to ladies. But although there is some difference, there are certain physical limitations, I cannot deny that. But you can say that they do deal us similarly. Most of the people think that Pakistan has very restrictions for women, but I want to say that no, it's not like that. They should come in Pakistan and see what Pakistan is actually doing. The aim of the PF is to train us uh, so that we can become the fighter pilots for Pakistan Air Force. I was not expecting that it would be so tough. What are the auxiliary hydraulic system limits, Mariam? But now I am here, I am used to it and I think I can carry on with it. I feel really proud of uh, with what I am doing. I, I really feel honoured that Air Force has given me the chance to work with them. PF has changed me in many ways because it has actually groomed me in many ways. It has groomed my personality, it has given me my own identity and a confidence to face the world. I think people would uh, appreciate what I am doing and they would also uh, think of their daughters and sisters to be where, where I am today.